Let's talk about George Kirby. Have that conversation. The ADP is 42.2 as the ninth starting pitcher off the board. The best control in all of baseball. He walked 19 batters over 31 starts. 0.9 walks per nine. Very clearly the best among qualified starting pitchers. His 104 whip over 190 and two-thirds innings was the third best whip contribution in fantasy last year. George Kirby has a great fastball, which gained nearly one mile per hour. Uh, went from 95.3 miles per hour in 2022 to 96.1. But the strikeouts are not there like other aces. Both his K per nine and swinging strike rate ranked 32nd among 44 qualified starting pitchers. Uh, strikeout rate did jump to uh, a K per inning in the second half, which coincided with throwing more splitters. Maybe he could unlock even more in 2024. Uh, but Chris, this is one of those pitchers where you kind of have to talk yourself into it. Yeah, but the strikeouts are going to come. And that's mm -hmm. why he's going to be a top 12 starting pitcher. Um, I think the ratios are still going to be good, but we do still have questions whether or not those strikeouts will be there. Yeah, I mean, one thing that, that is worth keeping in mind is the ERA was 335. The XERA was 390. Yeah. last season the quality of contact metrics for george kirby are not as good as you would expect I, I think a lot of people tend to assume that good command equals good quality of contact metrics and i think a, a good example of a guy like that was kyle hendricks but those that's not necessarily the case and i think you can reach a point of diminishing returns when it comes to limiting walks in a way that leaves you liable to to being too hittable because you're in the strike zone too much and maybe the splitter is the way that george kirby gets around that and it can, can become more of a swing and miss pitch i think the the arguments in favor of george kirby being you know in, in some cases a top five starting pitcher some people have him ranked i think they they rely on at times sort of tortured logic um, like, oh, the strikeout rate was up in the second half. Kind of. Like, it was. But it was really, he had three starts at the start of the second half where he struck out 26 batters over the course of 16 innings. His next 10 starts, he had 53 strikeouts in 62 innings. His strikeout rate immediately went right back to about 22%. Maybe the splitter changes that. I don't know, but it just... I think he's a high floor pitcher. And if you want good ratios, really great whip, I think George Kirby's a good bet to give you that. But well, I, I think we're we're assuming a lot in putting him in the fantasy ace tier when it's a very limited repertoire of pitches. He he technically throws five or six pitches. Maybe this again, I think a lot of it comes down to can the splitter be that pitch he can go out of the strike zone with. If it can be, then I think he he does have another level. But I think he's a lot closer to Brant uh, to Logan Webb than he is to Luis Castillo. I'd rather have Logan Webb. I don't get this ranking. I don't get this ranking for. I didn't get his ranking last year. I don't get his ranking this year. I don't get. I don't get what the deal is with George Kirby because he's not much of a strikeout pitcher. He did have a very, you know, he is a great control pitcher. He's one of the best control pitchers. He had a great whip last year. He also gives up a lot of hits. He's very hittable. His, mm -hmm. you know, as, as for as good as his control is, his whip in 2022 was 1.21 because he gives up so many hits. And he gave a lot of hits last year too. It wasn't quite as many, so the whip ended up being good. But if you're not a strikeout pitcher and First of all, in this environment, again, I don't trust ERA and whip contributions that much to begin with, but I I think people are assuming a little too, like, I, I guess the, the enthusiasm, oh, yeah, I, I get George Kirby as my ace and I never have to worry about whip again, but I, I don't think that's true. I think I, I think there's a lot more vulnerability there than people are factoring in.